Hyundai Mufasa 2023 debuts as an edgy design SUV. The Chinese car market is very attractive when you consider the large number of new models that are launched every year. One of the many local players is Beijing Hyundai Motor Company, a 50-50 to -50 joint venture created by Hyundai and BAIC in 2002. The company sells no fewer than five sedans, minivans, and several crossovers such as the larger Tucson and Santa Fe. One of them is the aging X35, which is believed to be replaced by this new Mufasa. Ahead of its public appearance at Auto Shanghai 2023 next week, the compact model has been revealed in official images. Beijing Hyundai published close-up photos on the Chinese social media network Weibo, which show an edgy design similar to that of the Tucson. Intricate vertical headlights and cylindrical taillights set it apart from the compact crossovers it is widely known for. Although technical specifications have not been revealed by Hyundai, this was indirectly announced when the Mufasa was homologate by China's Ministry of Industry and Information Technology. MIIT's website indicates that the compact crossover will be 176.1 inches, 4,475 millimeters, long, 72.8 inches, 1,850 millimeters, wide and 65.5 inches, 1,665 millimeters, high, much like the Tucson with the short wheelbase sold in Europe. It measures 105.5 inches, 2,680 millimeters, between the axles and has a curb weight of 3,227 pounds, 1,464 kilograms.
The same document reveals Hyundai intends to install a naturally aspirated 2.0-liter 2.0-liter engine with 160 horsepower channeled exclusively to the front wheels. Local media reports that the Mufasa will also be offered with a hybrid setup at a later date, possibly in a mild hybrid 48 volts configuration, but nothing is official at this point. Following its appearance at Auto Shanghai, the Mufasa will go on sale in China shortly thereafter. No word yet on bringing this model to other markets. Regarding the name of this model, it is taken from the name of Simba's father in the 1994 Disney animated classic, The Lion King.